the vote, but not just for the vote. I was just talking with Bill here about how he gets his medication right now. The post office is one of the bedrocks, it's one of the most basic functions of government. The fact that we have now gotten to where even the most basic functions of government are threatened because people <laughs> Democrat issue, it's all of us, all of the residents need the post office. Veterans have fought and bled for this country, and now they're unsure if they're going to get the medication that they need because Donald Trump is trying to suppress the post office because he doesn't want people to vote. So what I need everyone to do is register to vote if you haven't registered before. Make sure you early vote if you can. If you can't early vote, make sure to vote by mail because Donald Trump is trying to stop people from voting. And the more people that vote, it's better for our democracy. Uh, so again, I, I just wanna thank every one of you to, for coming out uh, to protect the post office. We desperately need it. Um, I never thought I would get into politics. Um, my background is community service. I've received awards from two different presidents for my volunteer service, and I'm trying to bring my community service to government, to bring resources that we desperately need, and to fight for the post office and other things that our community desperately needs. So if you want to get involved, you can go to stevepolgar.com or talk to me or Farzine. Uh, we'd love to meet you and work with you all. So thank you all for coming. Let's 
do that. One, two, three. Whose post office? Our post office. Whose post office? Our post office. Thank you for coming, Nancy.